Internet Marketing, How to Set Up Your Online Selling Platform When you begin your online business, one of the first things that you will need is a platform to sell your products, and on the internet, the ideal platform is a website. In this article, I am going to explain how you can set up your own business website. First of all you need to decide what name you will give your website. This is called the domain name and it could be the name of your business or if you provide services it might be your own name, you will need to find out whether the particular domain name that you want is available. Ideally, if your business is aimed at customers worldwide then you would choose .com domain. If your business was aimed at customers in a particular country then it would make sense to have a domain name that ends with something specific to that country. So for example, for a business aimed at the UK market, you would purchase a domain name that ends with .company UK. Once you have determined your domain name and you know that it is available you can purchase it and this means that no one else can have that same name. The next step is to set up and configure a hosting account. Basically, you need somewhere to host all of your website information. Once you have purchased hosting for your website, you need to connect your domain name with that hosting server. IT might take a few hours for this process to occur, but once completed, you will then be able to start adding and formatting your website. You may find that there are website templates available in your hosting account, so you can choose a template or theme that fits in with your business. I use WordPress, which is a free software for building a website on because it is very easy to use. You will be able to download WordPress from your hosting account. Once you have this platform to build your website on you can choose various designs and templates from within the WordPress dashboard. There are also premium themes that you can purchase if you so desire. There are many plugins that you can use with WordPress that are designed to make your site easier to use and to provide helpful features to your visitors and customers. You can then begin to add content to your website such as information pages about your products or if you choose to use your website like a blog you can add posts to update your visitors on what is happening in your business. You will also need to include legal pages and a contact page to keep within current regulations. In addition, you need to have some form of merchant account so that people can click on your buy button and be directed to a secure payment system. When you create your online website, you need to always keep in mind that it will be used by customers and therefore you must design it in a way so that it is easy for people to navigate around your site and find what they are looking for easily. Mm -hmm.